In this video we will talk about how to set up insurance from within the Corporate Control Center. Step one, you would need to log into the Corporate Control Center program. Then click on the insurance on the right hand side, insurance and protection plans. Then you would choose a respective site. Each site setup is site per site. In this particular case, I'm going to choose site one. Once I'm completed with site one, I would come back and choose site two and down the line. In this case, we choose site one and click next. Then you come into our site link marketplace, which shows our different partners that we work with. Click on the setup for the respective partner that you are going to work with. In this example, I'm going to use Bob Bader. I click on Bader and then on setup. In this particular case, we see Bader company chosen and the different coverage amounts on the right hand side and premiums. If your coverage and or premium is different than the default, you would click on the respective coverage click on edit on the right hand side and put in the coverage amount description and premium and whether or not it's currently used if there's an additional coverage click on the add button on the right on the left hand side we have a project number if given one from the particular insurance company place that in we have different options that are up to you choices on how you would want the insurance to work for example prorate premium on move out or policy cancellation. In other words, if your rent is due on the first of the month and the tenant moves out on the 15th, let's say the insurance is $10, would you want to prorate it? Would you want to say that they don't owe for the final five days of the month? That would be an option. Automatically cancel past due insurance policies on a cancellation date. So for example, the default being 30 days. If they are late for 30 days, if this was checked, it would automatically cancel the insurance. Use insurance protection plan name on all screens. Ignore non-standard name in charge setup. For some customers, they are not selling insurance, but rather protection plans. In the charge setup screen, you could change the word insurance to be protection plan or another similar name. By choosing this option here, it would not show insurance on the different screens it would show whatever name you've put instead of insurance, the typical one being protection plan. Do you have a re retained fee? If so, put in that percentage. The next option, allow returning refunds due to the customer. Normally this is done by the insurance company. Typically this would be an unchecked, but if you are a company that would do or process the refunds from within SiteLink, then click this option to allow it. If not, you do not have that as an option. The last option in this particular screen to enable tenant proof of insurance. Many facilities will require that you need to have insurance in order to move into the facility unless you have proof of insurance, typically homeowner's insurance. If this is checked, you will now have the option to put in the tenant's homeowner's insurance information instead of the typical insurance plan. Click OK to finalize the process.